Hey everyone, so this is going to be like a get ready with me video. Um, I am about to take a shower and so I figured this would be something kind of fun to do. So um, basically I haven't done anything today except for woke up and I got home really late last night so I didn't remove any of my makeup and my hair is a mess. So I'm about to go take a shower and I will see you when I'm out. Okay, so I'm all done in the shower. This is my after shower washed hair. I haven't combed it or anything. And um, I have nothing on my face at all. Um, I still have some makeup residue, which I will get off. But that's what happens when you don't wash your makeup off before you go to bed, which I didn't do. Um, so now I have to do something on the face of mine and uh, this hair. So, and um, let me show you. Kaden was being such a good boy. He was asleep when I took a shower. And he just woke up because I just got out of the shower. Let's see. Hey, baby. Hey, baby. Yeah, you're so handsome. You're snuggled on mama's side, huh? Yeah. Them baby legs. Look at them baby legs. You're so cute. He needs a bath, too. Oh, I don't know why that's out of fact. Focus. Alright, not really sure where that's out of focus, but anyways, he's adorable, as we, as we know already. Hi! Yeah, you're so happy! So, oh, sorry, I'm turning the screen around. Um, yeah, I'm gonna take you along so you can see my routine if you have any interest, which, I don't know why, like, I watch these videos when people do them, so maybe you have an interest. Maybe it'll give you an idea of a product you don't know about or something. Who knows? So, uh, yeah, I'm going to go set the camera up so I can do something to my face. And I'll see you in a few minutes. Okay, so I set everything up and I'm going to show you what I use on my face every day. And aside from pregnancy and right after my pregnancy, I have pretty decent skin. Um, I don't know if that's just me lucky or the things I use, maybe. I have no idea. Um... So yeah, so first I'm going to take my glasses off. Um, so a lot of the times, right when I get out of the shower, I use, it's a Neutrogena moisturizer that I get from Target. I don't have it with me, um, it's in the bathroom and I already used it, um, but I just put that on my face because in the shower, like, I scrub my face. Um, sometimes I use a uh, Clarisonic, sometimes I don't, it just depends on how much time I have. Um, which, as most of you moms know, if you have a baby, you don't have much time. So... Um, yeah, once I'm done that, um, now, let me just let you guys know, I don't do this every single day. This is when I have time. <laughs> Some mornings I have to rush out the door, so I skip half the steps, which I feel guilty about half the time, but it's what it is when you have a baby. Um, so yeah, so this is what I do when I have the time, and, um, I don't have to rush to get ready. And then I do even more, like, if we're going out or something, as far as, like, makeup goes. I don't normally wear that much makeup, um, which I won't be wearing a ton of makeup today either. <laughs> I will put the hydrating serum on first, just a tiny bit. Like, I don't know if you can see that, like, a little tiny, tiny bit. Um, and just rub it on the spots that I get driest, which is around my nose. Sorry, there's something blinking on my screen. I don't know what it is. My T-zone. Sit up. So I kind of just like let that sit in. Um, and then I wind up using the uh, daytime facial cream on top of that. Um, and this is still after I put a facial cream on. Okay, sorry about that. I had to move Caden, and I figured while I was up, I'll throw my hair up and grab the other moisturizer I used. So, I just put this on after the hydrating serum, because my face gets really dry and flaky all like on my nose. Um, so, this is the stuff I use directly out of the shower. So, it's oil-free moisture with SPF 15, which is really important if you have sensitive, fair skin, like I do. So, like, I put that on, 
I threw my hair out because it was getting on my nerves and it I haven't combed it or anything and I need to let it dry but I'll figure that out later. I'll blow dry it if I have to. And Caden's right behind me on his bouncer. If you can maybe say. So hopefully he cooperates for a few minutes for his mama. Anyways, so I do two things for makeup when I'm in a rush or when I'm just running to the store. Or usually when I'm going to work, unless I have more time. Okay, so the next step after moisturizer is eyeliner. <laughs> These Vader vlogs are going to be harder than I thought. Um, is eyeliner. <laughs> and I use uh, the MAC um, Eye Coal in Smolder. I don't know. You can... Smolder and it's really soft and the lid broke so that's why it just kind of hangs out like this on my table because <coughs> he's just making noise too he's not even upset or anything so I put that on my waterline <coughs> and above which And that's just mainly to define my eyes so I don't look washed out. <laughs> and then I curl my eyelashes and put mascara on. And that's all I do for my eyes. And a lot of people are afraid of these things, which you don't have to be. You just have to be really careful. One day I was using them. After telling my cousin she needs to get an eyelash curler. Because what it does is makes your eyelashes like flip up and like it makes you look more awake, I think. So I was telling my cousin, like, oh my god, you don't have an eyelash curler? You need to get one. Well, the very next day after that, I was using it. And I don't know what happened. Something made me jump or something. And I like pulled it and like all the eyelashes in like the center of my eye, like I ripped them out. It was so embarrassing. And the worst part is it was like a week before her wedding. Yeah. So thank God she had a makeup artist for us and part of the um, package was fake lashes. So yeah, that was good. Um, so next I put mascara on. Currently I have a, I have a mascara obsession so every time I go buy new mascara it's like a completely different one. I like trying all different kinds. So right now I'm using um, the Voluminous False Fiber Lashes in black. And so I'm going to do that right quick. I'm just going to use... And then I do a little bit on the bottom. And here comes my cat as a fair warning. So yeah, so I already look more awake and I feel more awake. So the next step I do, and this is pretty much it, unless I use concealer, which for once in a while my face actually looks pretty decent. I might do a little concealer under my eyes just because. Um, and I have the uh, Revlon Photo Ready in the lightest shade there is because I'm fair as crap. I just put it under my eyes and around my nose. That's pretty much all I do. And then I just kind of spread it out with my finger and you should do that after your eye makeup too just in case you make a mistake it helps correct it he is such a noisy kid but he doesn't cry that often so that's fine okay so after I do that the only other step I take is that I use a powder to kind of set everything and make my face look not so shiny and I use the it's CoverGirl and Olay 
just a powder, like a pressed powder. And I'm in the latest shade, I believe, which is Fair Light. It's number 320. And I have a tiny brush like this. And I just kind of brush it on. So that's all for face. And then I'll put chapstick on, which I have a whole bunch. I have like a ton of makeup. It's ridiculous. And in case you're wondering, this is um, Baby Lips by Maybelline. And it's just in like a clear color. It's really moisturizing though. So that's all for my face. Um, this camera is picking up a lot more freckles than I see in the mirror. <laughs> which is fine, whatever. I don't mind my freckles. Um, and soon I'll have to do something with my eyebrows. But this is all I do every day. It's pretty quick. Um, it took more time now because I was showing someone. Um, but yeah. So now I'm going to do something with my hair. Um, so yeah. I will see you in a minute. Okay, so now I'm going to do my hair real quick. I'm in our half bath that's attached to our bath, our bedroom. Um, and I'm fixing the rug under me so I don't trip and fall on camera. Um, I'm really not going to do much to my hair. Much more than what it looks like right now. Especially because Caden is behind me and he's unhappy. So I'm just going to comb my hair out and throw it up and then I'll probably straighten it later. So, um, yeah. Okay, so yeah, um, I'm just going to brush my hair. It's not that exciting. I have a lot of hair. My hair is naturally curly and becomes extremely frizzy when dry, which is why you normally see it straightened or up. Ouch. So, yeah. And if I straightened it on camera, I feel like it would be the longest video ever. But if anybody's interested, I'll do it to show you what I do. Um, maybe it will give you a tip or something. I don't know. And I shed like crazy since having him. I don't know why. I heard, I feel like that was normal. So, not really sure. But, um, yeah. So, all I do, ignore my fat arms, is I, here, maybe I'll do it from the back. I'm assuming you can see this. <laughs> Yeah, what? I take this kind of hairband without the rubber, or I mean the metal thing in it. I do that, and then I don't pull it all the way through. I can't really do the knot thing I used to do when my hair is longer because my hair is so short. So then I just kind of take my fingers and get bumps. Like it's supposed to be a messy do, so it's not supposed to look perfect. And any flyaways that I have, I use some water on. Kind of, kind of mess it a little bit, and then I spray a light layer of hairspray so it doesn't frizz. And the hairspray I use is Pantene Medium Thick Hair Style Hairspray, Anti-Humidity, Lots of Humidity, Maximum Hold. Ooh. Which I only use hairspray if my hair is up. So that's pretty much all I do. And I also don't use that much hairspray because if I straighten my hair tonight, I don't want my hair to be all sticky. So, as you can see, he's being angry, but this is me after I got ready. Um, just need to put some normal clothes on. Even though it is warm outside. I have to find, like, a shirt or something. And then, yeah. So, hopefully that was somewhat entertaining. I hope, and I can figure out how to edit it all together. Um, but thanks for watching, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!